Welcome to our Top Place segment hosted by your very own Tyler Simpson and our Australian correspondent, Mick Warren. Good day. All right, let's get on with it. Number five, we have Tony Hawk the fir- doing the first 900 on a skateboard. Brilliant spin by the old man. Fair dinkum, mate. I don't think he's going to come down. And look at the shape of the ramp, too. Looks like a parabola, like a quadratic function, like a y equals x squared quadratic function. Whoever knew that moth can make kids go flying, mate? For number four, we head over to New York. Eli Manning to Odell Beckham Jr. Touchdown! That's one of the best catches I've ever seen. Pause the video! What? Why? Why whenever a bloke scores a touchdown in American football, they always do the absolute value sign? What are you talking about? Right there. Mick, that's showing that he scored a touchdown. Well, in my country, they say, Y equals the absolute value of X is better than the rest. For number three, we head to Julius Yego and Javelin Throne. Look at those arms, mate. Mick, we're on live TV. Yego lets it go as the Javelin goes flying 92.72 meters. Rewind the video, please. Why would I do that? You need to see this, mate. The Javelin looks like a negative slope. Slap a graph on that, mate. Well, folks, that was 5 through 3. We're going to head to commercial break and come and see us after the break. Do you suck at basketball? Does your free throw look like Shaquille O'Neal's? Hi, I'm Reese Lester, and I'm going to help you get good at basketball through my product called Lucky Shot. Here's a clip of one of my clients before using Lucky Shot. And here's a clip of my clients after Lucky Shot. Splash! 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 Even Shaq endorses my product. In this graph, X is the amount of days using Lucky Shot, and Y is the percentage of the user's uh, shot percentage that goes up. Hi, I'm Hunter Simpson. And six strings, five fingers, changed my life. Now let's see a clip of me playing before I had six strings, five fingers. graph, X is the amount of weeks using six strings, five fingers, and Y is the amount of songs learned in that period of time. As you can see, it almost makes a perfect square root function, which is perfect. Welcome back to Sports Center. Let's start back right where we left off. For play number two, we go wingsuiting in Sweden. The suits almost look as tight as my granddad's budgie smuggler, mate. Pause the video. It's a rational graph suit, mate. What the? Right there. As you can see, Mick Warren is not only very annoying, but he is also a math nerd. Before we show the number one top play, we're going to head back to commercials. See you after the break. Do you want to learn how to skateboard? Hi, I'm Reese Lester, basketball mogul, and I'm here with a new product called Four Wheels, One Board. We learn how to ride one board that has four wheels. Let's take a look at someone before Four Wheels, One Board and then someone after Four Wheels, One Board. In this graph, X represents the amount of weeks using Four Wheels, One Board and Y represents the amount of tricks you learn. As you can see, slow but steady progress. If you ain't talking money, I don't want to talk. I'll call you back. You can tell I get Before Maurice Lester's program, Get That Dough, I was in debt. I didn't have any dough. But after Get That Dough, I got that dough. In this graph, X represents the amount of weeks 
with get that dough and why represents the amount of money that you have as you can see our clients came from very deep debt and now they're even making positive money so get that dough is the way to go now we're back to our number one sports center top play the Vikings hand it to Peterson at the 20. He hits a bunch of defenders and then somehow gets through to the 40, to the 50, to the 40. Touchdown, Adrian Peterson. Did you see that, mate? Cubic touchdown. Did you see the way he ran? Look at this, mate. His path to the touchdown represents a cubic graph. And that was the top play. See you again next week on SportsCenter.